Hi, this is Leslie Bowen with Inner Guidance Ministry and the Spiritual Circle. And I'm so happy to announce that we're back again. We have another event coming up this Tuesday from 7 to 9 p.m. And it is going to be spiritual stories. And we all have spiritual stories. Uh, all of us do, whether we know it or not. Some of them are pretty magical. And we're going to be talking about our true tales of our magical journey this Tuesday night. And anyone who has a spiritual story is welcome to join us and share their magical story as well. Um, I'm here with Carrie Hummingbird, and she is going to be one of our guest panelists here that's going to share her spiritual journey, which is a great one. Some of the stories that I'll be sharing are going to be like when the owl came crashing into my windshield and disappeared into white light. So I'll talk about some of the magical journey stories that I have um, experienced in my life. And I hope that you'll join us because we're really going to have a fun time. So Carrie, why don't you introduce yourself and talk about your um your, a little bit about your journey. Yeah, absolutely. So I'm Carrie Hummingbird, and I have had a really interesting seven year or so journey that I've been aware of with an ascended master called White Eagle. And he is an ascended master of awakening. And, you know, you kind of go along and you don't realize that all these things are all connected to the same thing. You just think there was this little moment where I had this thing happen or I had this little moment where I had this thing happen. And you don't really put them all together. And now I can put them all together <laughs> up until now. The story of, of my relationship with White Eagle. And I'm going to be sharing a lot of those little moments. There's are really cool ones. Um, and... It's really also going to be, I'm going to be sharing about the integration of this, um, you know, this uh, indigenous element within my own being uh, through my ancestry. I have Cherokee ancestry. And so part of the story I'm going to share is about this, uh, this visit to, to Cherokee uh, village in, uh, in uh, the Smoky Mountains, asking for a shaman, you know, to help me out, to connect me with my ancestry since I didn't have any third dimensional connection with my ancestry, right, is gone because she could pass for white. And so she changed her name and everything. And I was looking for like, okay, well, there's got to be another fifth dimensional way. And when I went to this village, I actually finally did get connected with a person who said he could help me, a shaman, so to speak, because they don't really advertise themselves. And as a result of that connection, I received this energy like through the back of my skull that I then began integrating. So we're actually going to talk about like, you know, what's it like to receive walk-in energy and what's it like to receive, you know, another consciousness that kind of joins you in your journey on awakening, you know, from your ancestry. So it's going to be pretty interesting. <laughs> A lot of things to share that are in my book as well, The Second Wave. Yeah, I think it's going to be really fun and I'm really looking forward to it. All of us are going to, you know, have such a great time listening to these stories and we'll be able to learn as well about our own spiritual journey and see what is possible. And that's the whole idea. So I'm so glad that you're going to join us, Carrie and uh, everybody. I hope that you come. Um, we have limited seating here, so sign up early. It is at the Inner Guidance House, 6409 Spicewood Springs Road in Austin, uh, Tuesday night, September 17th at 7 p.m. Okay, see you there. Bye-bye. Bye.